ladies and gentlemen this is walmart in roseville one of the largest uh retail centers in this whole uh area for the produce and uh other stuff but what you're witnessing right now is apocalyptic disaster consistent with uh, other cities in northern and southern california as probably uh, across the whole country and what we're witnessing here is there's no paper products such as uh, bathroom tissue or paper towels or clinics whatsoever there's nothing there everything you see has been uh, taken no eggs no uh, basic uh, produce I, I don't know what's going on here but uh, it's just a weird feeling of uh, total disaster and uh, unpreparedness like these people here just grabbing whatever they can no cleaning products no soap this is worse than 1980s in soviet union uh, when chernobyl striked this is really really bad and uh empty shelves uh, i haven't seen empty shelves like this since uh, 1989 uh, back in uh, Falling apart Soviet Union. Uh, this uh, is absolutely unprecedented. As I'm walking around the store trying to find some products, and uh, it's virtually all the necessities like basic cleaning products are mostly gone it's unbelievable the last of the, everything those empty shelves are supposed to carry I'm not even sure what those empty shelves were supposed to uh, have there I took a closer look uh, wow this is frozen food section eggs Water, drinking water, is gone. Water. Sour cream, butter, uh, pizza, frozen vegetables. Basically anything that can... Uh, be stored or frozen is gone. Cleaning uh, laundry uh, detergents and uh, soaps for the dishwashing uh, agents. Wow. This is just one of the stores that I have visited that day. Milk products, dairy products are like mostly gone. And uh, this is and the next day I went to visit at the uh, Rayleigh's. Uh, lots of people, it's supposed to be Wednesday, lots of people are supposed to be working, but it uh, looks like uh, shelves are empty for bread. Even you can see that uh, bread supplies are running out and anything that is dry food or something that you can store like canned food everything is gone wow. I'm present this is the dry soup and the canned products The water section. There's plenty of wine. As you can see, uh, people don't stock up on wine because that's not life's necessity. As you can see, no, not many customers in the store either.
a few items left. Hand sanitizer. Go on. Diapers. Baby diapers. Gone. Laundry detergent. Laundry detergents and uh, soaps for dishwashing and uh, bleaches. Anything that has disinfectant like chlorine looks like it's gone. What is this section? Here. Limit two. Even with uh, limited, uh, you know, items that they can release to a single visitor, still they don't have anything on the shelves. Literally, just a few things left. Dairy. People trying to keep the distance from one another. And, uh, it is what it is. Pancake mix, regular flour, vegetables, canned vegetables, canned foods, rice, beans. The fish department, the seafood department is closed. Look at people stocking up like there's no tomorrow. Look at the full cars of produce. Starbucks is not serving inside. There's nobody, uh, no visitors, no outside. People just drive through. So with the other retail stores like uh, cell phone stores, uh, haircut also has their own restrictions now. The stores are open, drive throughs just don't have cars. It's uh, very hard to imagine if they only serve products to go and not to go in. See if I can get them free from this place in a while. But here it is. So basically, uh, no gathering of any crowds anywhere. And this is city of Lincoln. So the uh, city of Lincoln has been one of the fastest developments and uh, new construction for new houses and communities in the past 10, 12 years and this is considered to be one of the most expensive areas in uh, developing California on the north side of NorCal. North
world mind probably never had so much a business. Ever. I've never seen a world mind being under stack of anything. Especially the items that come 24-7 and 30, uh, 365 days a year without any special requests. It's uh, not seasonal products. And they're all gone. I'm not even sure what the price means. Looks like oranges. Maybe the cereal section. Nothing for nothing. There's nothing. like there is a communism on every shelf like in uh, Cuba or like I said this is just however I don't see any lines of people lining up for the product like uh, let's say uh, early like people don't even use their cars that much they don't travel so the gas price went down because they were close to $4 now they're 